Coast now, so like every week I think about In and Out. <laughs> I'm really sad. Oh, I don't know. Have you gone to Wendy's? It's almost the same thing. Wendy's? No. no. Okay, I'm from the East Coast. <laughs> so Agatar started as a retelling of Beauty and the Beast. I, as far as I know, we've reached the end of that. I'm afraid I uh, You sound like hopeful. <laughs> if you were to Freaky Friday any two characters in Agatar, who would you do? And how do you think that would go? Okay, so like by that, you mean like switch, switch them, like brain. Like they would like they would wake up in someone else's body. Yeah, body. yeah. Okay. Oh my god. Um, I would like love to see Pharaoh wind up in Lucian's. Like, <laughs> with his like magic eye and he'd get like mad because like she was like messing with the settings and like all the programs. <laughs> That's like a magic like mechanical thing that you find out more about in book three. Ooh. Um, Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> uh, and then like oh my god like Lucian and Feyre's body like he would like first of all like probably feel himself up like, <laughs> in terms of like how these things feel. <laughs> be like totally weirded out with like Tam, like Tam, like Tamlin coming into that <laughs> <laughs> Oh Someone please write this. Be <laughs> 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 in Indoor bus. Indoor bus. Um, oh my god. Oh my god. Um, I'm trying to think of like what would be the most like awkward. <laughs> like, Get out! <laughs> um, I'm gonna say Kayal switched with. Like Kayal's like so nice that I'm just like trying to like see him being like, oh, I have these like murder tools built into my body. <laughs> no, I could also see like Manon and Fleetfoot. Like, <laughs> Brush her and it'll be okay. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> if your characters were to take a trip to Disneyland together, oh what rides are they gonna run to first? Now I'm trying to think of like all the like rides. Do you want me to like, you run them? Yeah, give me rides. like give me like shout a ride. Okay, we've got Space the Mountain Mansion, we got Space Mountain, awesome. we've got Pirates of the Caribbean. <laughs> <laughs> I think like it's a small world. I think like the Disney all would be on like it's a small world. <laughs> it's a safe ride. I think like Dorian would go to like Epcot, like for like the, like, like to the learn world statements. Yeah. Selena and Adian would go on like which everyone would make them puke the most. <laughs> Disney doesn't have real puke rides. No, Tower of Terror is like the scariest yeah, thing. Oh wait, they go on that one. Um, like Rowan would refuse to go on any of that. <laughs> well, he would know that like once like Selena gets like really like ill, like he'll need to like hold her hair back while she like pukes in the trash. And he also has no interest in like fun. <laughs> At the very end of the day, he would finally get on like the what's it, like the log ride. The logs of must let Splash Mountain. Yeah, Splash Mountain. He would go on that one with Aylin, just the two of them. And then, but then she would do like a really embarrassing photo. Like you know the people that pose on like the like, camera. Yeah. Like, she would like take out like a whole like table with like spaghetti and meatballs. <laughs> and no one would have no idea until he's like stuck in this photo forever. <laughs> and then it's like, no, we're never coming back here. <laughs> would Pharaoh go on rides? Um. No, I think. <laughs> would Tamlin go on rides? Is he not Tamlin right? would like go get like a turkey leg and like <laughs> <laughs> chow down. Um, Lucian would go on the rides, I think. He seems like a ride person. Yeah, and he'd be the guy that gets like like you know like the pickles, like that they sell like fries. <laughs> no, they're like they sell like pickles and like a few that we but who looks at the key? No, and like, I'm really bad at that. Like, I can't, like, figure out, like, how to, like, write that down. So, like, I think the key is, like, totally effed up. Awen, Ash River, Galathinius. Ash River? <laughs> oh my god, I'm like a sheepier. <laughs> <laughs> I love watching your videos. I'm like, sitting there, and I'm like, oh my god, she can't get a single one right. <laughs> River, but like with a, 
like a different vowel, like squad with like different like. <laughs> I'm like really sorry. Do you make them up from scratch? It's Did you mix. make up Ash River? <laughs> Ash River just came out of like nowhere. <laughs> so, like sometimes I'll just hear a name and like it'll be done. But then like a lot of the time I go on like babynames.com and I'll be like, what's an Irish name for like sexy warrior? <laughs> And I will make like a whole like chart of all the like hot sounding names. <laughs> and I, I make them based on like my idea of hotness. Hot um, sounding. So which one of these are supposed to be hot sounding? Adian. <laughs> I guess he does sound. All right, we've got Adian Ash River. I'm sorry. Like I didn't realize Ash River was like the joke. It kind of sounds joke. like Ash River. And that's, <laughs> that's why it's so that's funny. Your, that's, that's why I love watching your videos. <laughs> Goes with you. You see sounds that I don't think exist. <laughs> <laughs> got Dorian Havilliard. Yeah. Yeah. Havilliard. 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 Havilliard.
is her. That was her question. Was it? The Tesla Pottermore. I know, but like I have not done that. Oh my god. No, like, you I have, have to do it. I bet you're not Slytherin. No, but like I don't want to be confirmed as a Slytherin. <laughs> <laughs> you just lying. Tell them you don't you I don't, don't want to live right like <laughs> under the lake. I don't want to live in the dirty dungeon. Like I want to live in the tower. So I would maybe be like a Slytherin who has like such horrible like phobias and like anxiety. do that too. What? <laughs> anxiety. <laughs> Okay, I would say like you have a chance of being Ravenclaw or Gryffindor. Wait, what, what are you? I'm Ravenclaw. I think the test four times. Solid. <laughs> I don't want to be like I. I only want to be a Gryffindor. You can say not Slytherin, not Slytherin. <laughs> What's your favorite vegetable? Red pepper. Bell pepper! Yeah. Yeah. Only, only like raw, I don't like it cooked. Yeah. I, do you like any of those green ones? Like yeah. the kale? Like any kale? <laughs> Are you a fan of kale? No, I actually like spit out. Do you like Dorian better? Yeah. <laughs> vegetable. Uh, I like cucumbers. Yeah. I like cucumbers. So cucumbers. No one's ever asked you what your favorite vegetable is? No. This was like my question for like a year and everyone like, everyone looked at me and said literally, is this your idea of small talk? <laughs> no, I'm just curious. <laughs> so seriously, what's your favorite? <laughs> Broccoli. That's a good one. That's a good one. With like a physical book? With a physical book. <laughs> and then I throw it out of the shower when I need to actually like wash myself. <laughs> Finding out the truth. Oh, <laughs> After I die, what people 
say what would you what do you want them like people to do when they hear your name when i'm dead yeah miss you <laughs> smile ask for more stories about your adventures think, yeah <laughs> think with admiration of your achievements or i don't care what people think of me i'm dead i'm dead <laughs> <laughs> um, what's like the, the admiration part? I love that. <laughs> These are like, I thought it would be like pick an animal. Like, like. Alright, what's my next one? Cat, owl, or rat for you? <laughs> now, now I've got the choices. Uh, owl. Okay. Tawny owl, screech owl, a tawny owl, a screech owl, snow owl, or snowy owl. I would go with a screech owl because it sounds the most predatory and vulnerable. <laughs> well, I'm being sorted right now. <laughs> what are you most looking forward to learning? Yeah. Um, what hot yeah. oil do you have for dating? Not an option. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, apparition, disapparition, transfiguration, broomstick flying, hexes and jinxes, all about magical creatures, secrets about the castle, or every magic area I can learn. Um, I'm gonna say every magic area. That is a really good law answer. That's okay. <laughs> this is like so high pressure. I, I can't even like think right now. I don't even know. <laughs> he lets you pass. Do you attempt to confuse the troll into letting all three of you pass without fighting? Suggest drawing lots to decide who fights. Suggest that all three of you fight. Or volunteer to fight. What's the, what's the one of the unit, the three of us fighting? The three of you fight, or there's one that's attempt to confuse it to let you all pass without help. No, the three. Three, three fighting. Skate <laughs> thought he was hot being able to do 150 in an hour. No. <laughs> yeah. No. Skate thought he was the man, yeah. Please get yourself together. Right, right. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, here it comes. Five minutes and five minutes. What? No, what? She's up on that! I took the test I, while, we, while we were sitting there just to see, and I ended up in Slytherin. <laughs> Naturally. I mean, Dana, would you That's what I get for trying to condemn you. Sit on my oh my God. Would you? <laughs> this is your true path. You just answered them all differently. Now you can be Cedric Diggory. I know. Uh, I won't think. Okay. Like, <laughs> this. I'll tell you more about your house so you'll know how you are. Okay. I don't give a shit about my house. Right? Now I feel bad for condemning her to Slytherin. I never cared about them. <laughs> <laughs> they are loyal, patient, fair, and hardworking. And true. You're hard okay, working. Okay, I guess I am those things. Yeah. I am like my only good trait is I'm Look, loyal. they make the best friends. <laughs> But aren't Gryffindors and loyal to their friends? No, I guess Peter Pettigrew was a Gryffindor. But, yep. Do you find things really like? <laughs> Are you the one to find it? Yes. That's a Hufflepuff. That's great. That is like the best thing about Hufflepuffs. Okay, look. Also, Joe herself said that Hufflepuff is the best house. They're just boring to write for. Because they're so wonderful. She said in the Battle of Hogwarts. <laughs> just saying, in the Battle of Hogwarts, all of the houses were had the option of staying or leaving. Half of Slytherin left, most of them left. Ravenclaw half stayed. They were like deciding what was the smart thing to do. <laughs> Gryffindors all stayed because they, they would they get their names in glory in the end. And all of the Hufflepuffs stayed because it was the right thing to do, not because of its glory. I'm gonna yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I need to like go home and not like, a bad thing, to, but like, assess everything in my life. <laughs> 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 Out of all the houses, I never would have picked myself for a Hufflepuff. <laughs> 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 it's our best, and there's the Hufflepuff. <laughs>